Number four, express the following angles in radians. So letter A, we have 20 degrees and we want to express this in radians. How we do that? We just multiply it by 2 by radians over 306 degrees. So we just have to make 20 degrees over 306 degrees times 2 pi times radians. And this gives us about 0 0.349 radians. So this is letter A. Letter B, we have to do the same thing for 50 degrees. And we just multiply it by 2 pi over 360 degrees and multiply it by radians. So this is about 0 0.873 radians. Letter C, 100 degrees. 100 degrees. So we could just multiply this by 2 if you want, but let's start over. So multiply it by 2 pi, divide it by 260 degrees times radians. And this is 1.75 roughly radians. So this is the, the answer of letter A, B and C. Letter D, convert the following angles to degrees. So we have to do the, the, the process, but in the, in the opposite direction. So we have 0 0.333 radians. And if you want to convert these two angles, we have to do the opposite what we have done over here. So we will multiply by 360 degrees and divide it by 2 pi radians. So this is 0 0.33 over 2 pi times 360 degrees, because you can cross out radians, right? In the first three, we could cross out degrees. So this is equal to 18.9 degrees. So this is the answer of letter D. Letter E, it is 2.1 radians, and this we have to multiply by 360 degrees and divide it by 2 pi radians. And this would be 120 degrees. Letter F, letter F we have 7.7 .7 radians, so we have to multiply it by 360 degrees and divide it by 2 pi radians. And this is 441 degrees. And this is the answer of exercise number four.